Hi guys, we're here with the $100 soccer ball launcher. You guys had some questions on how we made it. So we're going to do a little closer in depth look here. And you can see the basic frame is just basically some 3x3 tubing welded into the shape of a T. On that tubing, we got some tabs there with a bunch of holes because we weren't sure exactly where to put the motor. This let us adjust the motor for a number four ball, number five, whatever. Kind of learned as we went. Bought the wheels at the local hardware store, cheapies. They're junk, but they work. And we bought the better pneumatic tires with the tubes off of eBay with the rims. We got 90 volt, uh, 2500 RPM DC motors. Bought that off eBay. We've got some conduit here. I bent up this regular conduit bender. That's our ball chute. All right, drop the balls in. Got a little flapper here. It kind of helps steady the ball a little bit as it goes down. And of course, we've got two different controllers on our control panel here, and that's so we can speed one wheel up more than the other, put a little bit of English on the ball. That works pretty good. And this year, we kind of made a little addition, and that was a little bit of a kickstand there. It was an afterthought, but it seems to work pretty good. And with that, we can change elevation of our ball by hitting a switch. And, lo and behold, it drops down pretty good. So that's it, guys. 100 bucks, a bunch of junk parts, lots of fun here in Willow, Ohio.